Hey guys, Lee here. I'm at The Fountains by Blue Green Vacations. Um, it's a timeshare and you can also um, get rates, nightly rates here. It's on International Drive. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys around. They got a very big pool, which is really, really cool. Um, follow the adventure. All right, so here at the Fountains by Blue Green Vacations, it's a timeshare. Um, 569 rooms, two and three bedroom apartments. You can either use timeshare or rent. Uh, the rent is like 360 a night, or the going rate or whatever. Um, each one comes with a full kitchen and a, and laundry, and it uh, sleeps eight up to eight people. So. You know, for 360 a night for eight people, it's not terrible. It's uh, a little bit away from Disney's. It's down on International Drive, kind of in between SeaWorld and Disney. It's very popular, though. It's always very, very busy. So I'm going to give you a quick show around. Um, let's get into this. So Blue Green partners with NASCAR. So if you like NASCAR, this might be a resort for you. This is a really cool photo op of a... Uh, one of the race cars parked out front. And it's an actual race car that they was used in a race. So that's pretty cool. When you first walk in, complimentary water. And to the left, they got the market. I thought it said they had a Starbucks. I'm gonna have to look around a little bit. That does not look like it's, oh yeah, it does have Starbucks coffee back there. So the market is basically a Starbucks. Oh yeah, see, Starbucks. And they got different breakfasts. They got different pastries, drinks, cakes, grab and go food like sandwiches, muffins, some fresh fruit, donut holes. There's the fruit. They have like the parfaits, hard boiled eggs. Ooh, expensive. Three hard boiled eggs, five fifty. Well, vacations are cheap. On the back side of the Starbucks, they actually have a place called Corks and Crafts. It's a Little, little bar area. I guess it opens at night. Oh yeah, here, we got bar hours here. Open, oh wow, open at 10 a.m., closes at 10 p.m. So you can get your drink on early here. Here's a quick start at a look. It sits on this giant lake, very pretty view. And this is um, part of the pool. It's a very big pool. Once I get down there, you'll see it. And they got a little kid splash pad over here. Then over here in this corner, they got a little like gift shop type area, pool stuff. Mostly pool stuff and a couple little trinkets and stuff. Nothing too crazy. Across from Starbucks, they have a little waiting area. And then they, as you turn, you got the concierge off in the right, cor in the right corner. And then you got the front desk checked in dead center and middle. Interesting, this is usually on. It's not on today. I don't know, maybe it's just broken and they're waiting to get it fixed. But this usually has all your flight times and stuff so you can stay on top of your flight and when you got to get out of here and get to the airport. It's right where the information center sign is. Okay, on the third floor, you have an activity center. There's restrooms off to the right. There's also in the lobby off to the right, same area, restrooms. So basically the activity center is, looks like it's just an arcade. Flappy Bird. You got air hockey. It's actually a pretty decent sized arcade. Let's just kind of walk through here. Oh, we can go fishing. Big bass wheel. What's over here? It looks like a little office room. No, I don't know, a business center if you gotta get on a computer for work. 
we got more arcade games. Oh, there's a uh, porch. We'll check that out in a second. Another air hockey. There's actually quite a few games here. You could have a lot of fun on a rainy day. Got the old timey basketball game. About the only thing that's missing. And ski ball. Is this ski ball? Nope, they got ski ball. Whoa, this giant Space Invaders is awesome. The lights are very trippy. They also have an activity center. There's a bunch, there's like a team meeting going on in there, but there's coloring activities. Let me see. Looks like you can rent fishing poles to go fish in a lake. It looks like there's different crafts and activities. Different sports balls for the, the, the ball courts. I'm sure there's a basketball court here somewhere. I'm sure there's a tennis court too, but I don't see any tennis stuff. You see, there's been a lot of artwork done on these tables. And it looks like at some point you can get some popcorn as well. I love the chalk artwork, the Halloween stuff on the back wall there. And they actually have free crafts. It says there's two free crafts per person, so take advantage of that. So they have a table tennis out here, and there's also an indoor pool, I guess, if it's raining outside. And it actually attaches to the outdoor pool. And this looks like an outdoor bar. Splash. Yep, outdoor bar. Pretty cool. And they have a hot tub sitting over there. Wow, this is cool. They got a steam room. So if you want to get a steam on. And here is the outdoor pool behind the lobby. Now, it says they have water slides, so I'm going to have to do a little exploration. There definitely aren't here. There's restrooms here outside as well. But hey, it's peaceful out here. And I love the view over the lake place is gorgeous and here's a look at the steam room I would love to have a sauna at the campground they have a fitness center it's kind of dark right now oh, there's somebody in there walking up oh, working out and there's a lot of people actually getting their exercise on in there I'm not gonna go in there but they also have restrooms blockers it's like there's a men's locker room and a women's locker room. Let's see what else we can find down this way. This is one of two shuttle buses I've seen here. And I don't know if any are in service right now, so they might even have more, I guess, to get you to the parks. So I can't get into this area as you need a room key. It's called Wakula Springs. This is where they have um, two water slides. They're kind of tame. Looks like you can play water volleyball. It's open 8 a.m. to 10, uh, 10 p.m. Bathing load of 107, so that tells you how big the pool is. Right here in the shade, they got a nice little hot tub, too. But that's about the best look I can give you, since I'm not actually staying here. If you like these videos, please click that subscribe button, tap the like, and ring that notification bell, so you always know when a new video is headed your way. Thank you so much for watching, and now we're on to the next adventure. Bye, guys! Today's video brought to you by Orlando for Families. For amazing prices and even better customer service on all of your stroller rental needs for your Orlando vacation, visit them at the website listed below, www.orlandoforfamilies.com. Use the promo code OHANA to save 15% off of their already competitive prices.